And finally, Gilmore. Goes in. They're off. Flat on began slowly at the rail. Navy man, Massimo, Sully getting out to flash speed and putting ahead in front. Bluegrass loot now comes away four, then Gilmore, four lengths off the leader, being pushed to get in the race early. Two lengths back to hard times, a gap of seven back to flat on, racing greenly in the early stages. They go for the half mile pole and Sully hits the ground running. Sully's got sharp speed, leading Massimo by a half length. Navy Man is a length and a half back, chasing in third, Gilmore improving to fourth. Bluegrass Lute is now losing ground, back seven, now eight lengths off the leader. Two back to hard times and a distance back to flat on. A spaced out field on the far turn now at the 516's pole. And Sully feels the pressure of Massimo. Massimo tries to crack Sully, they lead by two. Navy Man in the perfect spot, third. Gilmore continues to work hard to make an impression and four back to bluegrass loot off of the turn and sully digs in tenaciously sully is not done fights back on the inside of massimo in the final furlong sully is coming back massimo tries to put him away navy man and gilmore navy man is coming to life late has to get to massimo navy man massimo massimo to win it massimo navy man gilmore got up third sully weakened to fourth the unofficial results of the sixth race. The winner was number five, Massimo. Second, number seven, Navy Man. Third, number six, Gilmore. Again, fourth, number four, Sully. Five, seven, six, and four, unofficial. The running time at six furlongs, one minute nine in 70 one hundredths. Now, entering the winner's circle, number five, Massimo. He's a two-year-old bay colt by Uncle Mo from Mary Meadow by Henny Hughes, bred in Kentucky by Windstar Farm. Winning owners are SF Racing, Starlight Racing, or Medicaid Stables. Winning trainer is Bob Baffert. Jockey Juan Hernandez rides his second winner today. <laughs> 